I've never seen Dad get that mad. It really scares me. The treasure map is not secret anymore. It's mine. Yes, I can hack any system. Let's start.
points. I would love to see Hot Dog Man team up with Captain Spirit. Mom was so pretty. I miss Mom's smile.
Dad never threw away Mom's hiking boots. Good. Thanks for storing my explosives, Chief. Now I'm ready to rock. Sorry, Dad. <sighs> Grandma and Grandpa were so nice. I wish we saw them more. I know Dad spent a lot of money on the funeral. A lot. Now you are ready to battle with Captain Spirit. Yes! So cool! No man's fear almost froze the whole city until Captain Spirit melted him. For now.
Chris, these are the most important numbers for you on this list. Oh yeah, uh-huh. Cool story, Dad. Come on. Hello? Mrs. Reynolds? H hello? Okay. That was weird. Now that's a superhero. Here I come, Mantroid. Come on, let's get going. This is Captain Spirit, do you copy? Are you there, Sky Pirate? Captain Spirit, I read you loud and clear. Are you sure you want to go on this dangerous mission? Don't worry about me, Mantroid is the one in danger. Gotta do a quick system check first. Instrument panel, check. Force field, check. Proton missiles, check. Skate pod, check. Windshield wipers, check. Everything looks good. Start the launch. We're going faster than light speed. What's that ahead? Oh no, meteor showers. Turn on the force field. Too late. Emergency! SOS! Crash landing! Ah! I wonder how many ships Mantroid has crashed on this planet. Never mind. I landed safe. Time to explore! The planet is so dark, and the sky is so red, like blood. No wonder man Troyd lives here. But how could anyone live here? It's kind of sad and lonely. What's that sound? Something is coming. Or somebody. Dare come to my planet. Man, Troy, show yourself, you coward. Too 
This time, you won't get away from me. <laughs> I don't have to get away because I'm everywhere. Fight me instead of hiding. You will pay for what you did, Mantroid, I swear. We never use this door in winter because of the snow. seeing him like this. Dad, you, you sleeping? Hey, wake up. Dad, come on. Huh? What? Who's there? Who's that? Dad, it, it's just me, Chris. Whoa, whoa, hold on, buddy, okay? Jesus. Do I look okay? No. I tripped. Can't even watch one goddamn game. Fuck! That's just great. Oh, I think I sprained my foot. Shit. Chris, why did you wake me up? You, you told me to wake you up. I thought... I thought you said the pine tree. <sighs> pine tree? I can't even walk in my own house, man. You should be careful when you're, you know, when you wake up. Don't be a smart ass, Chris. I'm not in the mood right now. Yeah, Dad. 
Okay. Jesus Christ, who is that? Go answer. If it's some salesperson or some church group, you just close the door on them. It's nobody's business. This is our castle, and it's our family. Right? Right. Oh my, look at you. What kind of costume is that? I'm Captain Spirit. Of course you are. We need all the superheroes we can get. And how are you doing, Chris? Good, Mrs. Reynolds. Just, just. Just? Just hanging out playing video games. You boys and your video games. You should play games outside like we used to. Like your dad used to. Oh, I know, I know. I'm old. But I did see you clearing that snow off the front porch. So good of you. Actually, I, I was going for a nice walk, but it sounded like the 4th of July over here. Is everything okay? Of course. We didn't hear a noise. Are you sure? Lordy, I thought, I don't know, but it was loud. And there's no other houses around. You probably heard me and my dad watching the game. He kind of go crazy, so. Hmm. You're not the only one. I must be hearing things. I hope you have something else planned for today. I wanted to fix up the treehouse. Maybe Steven could come by and help? Well, that sounds like a fun job for a father and son, right? Oh, my dad wants to, but he's super busy today. Too busy on a Saturday to help you with the treehouse? Yeah, he's tired from work and stuff. Plus, he's got to support his team. Maybe he should support his son instead. There's always another game, right? This is a pretty big game, and he promised to help me later. You're a good son, Chris. Listen, Chris, I'm only steps away from your house. If you ever feel scared, you can come visit us anytime, day or night. Understand? We're here for you. Okay. Sure. Thanks. Thanks, Claire. I promise I'll see you later. So what did that nosy bitch want? N nothing. Oh, nothing, huh? I was listening. I heard it all. You could have gotten rid of her. I tried. Man, I bet you want to tell her what a shitty dad you have. Huh? No, she just wanted to say hi. I didn't say anything, Dad. I swear. Dad, please believe me. Jesus, stop that whining. You're not a baby anymore. Oh, boo-hoo, Daddy. 
believe me. Grow up. But I... You're just... Just like your mom. Every time I look at you, I tell me you talk. Stop it. I, just, I see your face. Why? And if it wasn't for you, she would have never taken the car that day. Never. Oh, hey, Chris, look, hey, I didn't mean that, buddy. Yes! Yes, you did! No, listen, Chris!